immediately for my first college visit and I'm gonna bring you guys along. So let's start the process. So I'm actually not going to tell you guys which college I'm looking at because right now this is my top college and I don't want to have to come on the internet and be like, hey guys, I didn't get in. So that's why I'm not telling you. But one thing that is exciting, I got a meeting with the English and Creative Writing Department, which is what I want to major in. So I'm trying to figure out like what I can wear to be like, like I can walk around the campus but still look like semi-professional, you know? So I'm thinking this Hard Rock t-shirt, which you guys have seen many a time, and this denim skirt, which I wear all the time, but you guys obviously don't see it because my videos are typically from here. So I think that's what I'm going to end up doing. I did consider, let's see, where is it? I did consider this butterfly shirt, which I also love, but I'm wearing my zoo shoes because these are my best walking shoes. I have socks stuffed in here. You can always bring extra socks, right? So I need to wear these, so I need the outfit to look decent with these, which is why I didn't go with the butterfly shirt, which is why I didn't go with the butterfly shirt because I feel like that would have made it like a lot dressier and then these would have looked out of place. So we're going to be leaving really soon. It looks like my brother might come, which is amazing because he's the best. <laughs> I'm not going to show him on camera because he's 11 and like safety, you know, even though he would want to, it's like, no, but, but you know, um, I'm driving part of the way. And one thing that I just love is like a good car drive beat roll. So. Um, if you see any of that, which you're probably going to, I'm not driving, my dad is, which you'll probably see, uh, because of which side the camera's on, but you know, super fun this, what did I just say, okay, um, yeah, we're gonna be leaving for the college, maybe an hour.
I see a building that looks like it. And that's another residence hall. I don't remember what it's called. So I did not film as much as I thought I was going to be. Like, I didn't know what to expect. This was my first college visit. I did get a little bit of B-roll, but I did not do, like, any talking like this. So let's just debrief for a hot sec. So we got onto campus, like, super early. Like, we got into the city, like, 45 minutes early. So while we were there, it's like, hey, while we're here, might as well like kind of drive around, figure out what the vibe is like. And then we also drove by two churches in the area. One of them I'm very interested in. And then we parked and we got to our destination, like kind of. So we got to their admissions building and that's also like their counselor. So like, okay how am I going to graduate on time kind of thing and from there we had orientation orientation I guess it was like a slideshow presentation just going over the school the perks of the school just kind of what to expect if you go to this school and then after that um we took a walking tour of the campus and oh my gosh it is such a cool campus honestly in their rec center they have a rock climbing wall and if you guys didn't know I was a competitive rock climber for a few years while I was on the rock climbing team I got to meet Megan Martin I went to regionals many many times I got fourth in a local comp once after shredding my finger like completely open it was really bad I don't have a picture of that but I kind of wish I did <laughs> um and I ended up quitting to pursue my black belt and it would be so much fun to just get back into climbing. It was honestly the only sport I would ever consider doing. <laughs> and after that we took a tour of a resident tour of a residence hall we got to see a singles room and we got to see a doubles room and just kind of talked about like dorm life and like for example there are um guest policy in the dorms is like kind of you're an adult do whatever the heck you want but uh, we'll see we'll see what well, me and my roommate will have like a conversation about guests and such and um, oh, one more thing. Surprisingly, there is a decent chunk of mental health resources on campus, which I love. You guys know I have struggled with some mental health things, and so having those resources is really, really amazing. And what else? Um, well, okay. After we toured the residence hall, we got, like, free food, which is always a good thing. And it was actually pretty good. Like, they had quite an array of options for food. I got, like, pizza and pretzel bites and a Rice Krispie Treat, and it was freaking amazing. I loved it. Like, like I wouldn't say freaking amazing. Like, it's probably, like, it's not high school food, but it's like cafeteria food, if you know what I mean. Like, kind of basic, like, not, it's not a, not a five-star restaurant. Let's just say that. And then after that, I went to the Museum of Natural History there. Honestly, the one, the old one in the city I live in now is much cooler than that one. That one was kind of, eh. But it was still pr pretty cool. <laughs> 
it kind of reminded me of the field museum like that one section like when you walk in the main doors and you come in and it's like right after africa that like area of taxidermy and stuff like it, it was really cool and i swear i saw one of them move like anyway um, then I had a meeting with the English and Creative Writing Department. None of the professors were there, but, um, I got to meet with a rising senior, and she is also, and she is a, an English Creative Writing major, and they just, this specific college is so well known for their English program. It's kind of like their thing. And that's honestly what I want. I want to major in creative writing, and it's really hard to find a major program in creative writing. And honestly, it's amazing. One of the professors at this school is the author of a book I read freshman year of high school for school, and it's the only one I actually like. Good night, fish. And it's so cool. It's so cool. And they have like these writing workshops, which like I haven't even been a part of one. It, but I'm I'm in love. <laughs> and then after that, we went over to the other side of campus. So there's like a river dividing uh, campus in half. So we went to the other side where I will have, I probably won't have any classes, but that's also where like medical care is. That's kind of where the arts area is. And it's also um, where four of the 10 residence halls is. And then after that, we crossed over again. And then we went to this adorable bookstore. Like, so from what the senior told me, you can like, so this bookstore, it has three levels, children's book on the bottom. And then you have like your main books on the ground floor. And then top floor, you have more books. And they have like a little coffee shop. And from what the senior was telling me, like, legit authors will be in there like this city is such a writer's town it's one of the most common stops on book tours and they have like writers talks all the time going on and they have a lot of like writing festivals they're like a certain some a something city of literature and it's so cool. Like, legit, if I don't go to college here, I will live here for at least a year. It is so freaking cool. I can see myself, like, settling down, living there. And, like, if I have a family, like, oh, my gosh. Like, I'm really excited. So, anyway, after the bookstore, we went and we got food. We got, like, 10% off because I was, like, pouring. And, I mean, pretty good. I got a Caesar salad and it came with bacon and cherry cheese and like the typical stuff in a Caesar salad. And then we went and got boba because my brother wanted to get boba when he came. But like I said, he couldn't make it because he, because he wasn't feeling well. And then we drove home. And, uh, so, time update. So, this is the day after we got back. We didn't get home until midnight 30. 12.30, sorry. 12.30 in the morning. And, um, I couldn't vlog then. I, I fell asleep within the first 10 minutes of hitting my pillow. So, yeah. Anyway, I am going to end this video here. I will see you guys next week with more writing content. And yeah, wish me luck as I wrap up my last two years of high school. Anyway, I'll see you guys next Saturday. Bye.